fled together and they continued from one day to the next. Hello self! I am at Glen Park with Doggett somewhere. There's a Doggett, I swear. I lost her. There's a Doggett. Let's look at the weathers. So far this year, it's been pretty sunny. Oh, oh, there's a foggy patch. I guess we're, we're in a foggy patch right now. There it is, burning it in. I just dropped Sabetta and I want to say Steve. It's not Steve. Henry. <laughs> I just dropped Sabetta and Henry off at the bar. They were only here for a few days. They're on like a whirlwind adventure. Um, I did a bunch of VR stuff this morning for work, which I can give a tour of. Maybe tomorrow is a good day for that. Once it has a little more progress in it. Dog peeing. Uh, doing my, doing my uh, leg brace. Not so, not so excited about it for driving. Uh, it definitely takes some getting used to, but we shall see. I'll get used to it. Um, it the more I wear it, the more it gets stretched out. So let's see if it does okay. We came home from the park and then it got real pooped out. So now I'm taking a nap in the studio. I was supposed to be cleaning up the studio so that I could work down here because Henry and Sabetta and all guests always stay in my studio. But then I got sleepy. So Steven and I are watching Thor Norvash do on behalf of all Muslims at the Brava this evening. And her cards are all over the thing. You gotta have your notes. Stretch. Oh. Man. Okay, straight up yawn. I really enjoyed this show. I haven't seen a comedy show that's in development. Um, she is a fellow. Zahara. No, no, sorry. Zahra is a fellow at the pop culture collective something like that um and she's developing this new show um called on behalf of all muslims and it was interesting to see she's like testing out these different stories to see if what she wants to keep and what she doesn't mm. oh, sorry and one of the things i really liked about it was um she is a uh, first generation uh, immigrant or first generation her, her parents were immigrants and there's a lot of like commonalities to those stories but it's interesting like she talked a lot about ducktales um, which is apparently like a cartoon um, with a rich duck who goes on adventures um, and she talked about like Mario 3 there's all these like sort of um, American pop culture cornerstones that she talks about as like integral parts of her childhood. I don't remember any of these things, but um, they do definitely feel like um, things Americans know and things Americans associate with being American. Um, so it's interesting, like how the how she used pop culture as like the the touchstone of her. Of her thing and ham ducktails and ham that's what the show was about it was pretty funny though um so yeah 